Our videos are made possible by Ranger Rob Poopy Bags, available at Amazon right now. Hello everyone, this is Ranger Rob from the Ranger Rob Country Living. And I have discovered something has made a mess on the side of our house. My gosh, this used to be a trail. It started over there. What could it be? Uh, let's see here. I think I found the culprit. Ow! Ow. <laughs> Those deadly roses. <laughs> so what are you doing? I'm kind of thinning this out, getting the stuff that's right up along the side of the house back. We'll cut out all the little uh, little sapling suckers there yeah. and rake it out before we get the siding done. Yeah, so, this was kind of the last part of the house that really needed cut back. And we've been kind of dinking around today and the weather's really nice. And uh, I think we finally got a little enthusiasm to get back in there. So it's been kind of Sherry's baby. Um, Belle, come on. But got lots of helpers. What are you doing, Belle? Get him, Belle. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Talks a dork. Anyway, well, it looks nice, kinda, until you look at our trail. Hey, stop! Stop! Well, oh, you got a helper. <laughs> Ow! That looks like it hurts it. Cinder. You said that. He's almost. Mm. Yeah, so we got some roses in here, and uh, yeah, they hurt. Well, I thought I'd show you guys. Of course, I have a cat. I think either found a lizard or is chasing a mouse. And of course, Belle's got a helper. But anyway, we'll, we'll see how that goes. Anyway, I thought I'd show you like where we uh, control our watering system. We have a 16 different zones. Uh, and we keep the controller right here in the pump house. And it's right here. And uh, yeah, it's... Uh, I'm, we haven't totally figured this thing out. <laughs> I don't think anybody has really. Oh, I got some helpers. Hi, guys. What are you looking at? Hey. Hello. Squirrel. One thing I can always count on is my helpers. So Sherry, when she mows the lawn, she usually shuts off the... Uh, uh, sorry about the light. Uh, shuts off the uh, zones um, for a couple of days. And we realize we've had it off for about three days. So um, anyway, I'm going to uh, turn it back on. And what we do is we water... Uh, 20 minutes on each zone in the evenings um, at night time when we're about 9 o'clock in the evening and then it comes back on again for 20 minutes for each zone uh, in the mornings at about 4 in the morning and uh, the only reason I thought is we're getting close to not running the system anymore uh, it's starting to cool down uh, we have, still haven't got a lot of rain. And then here's our darn moles again. So while we're here, I'm going to stomp down some of these things here. But we'll probably have to mow maybe, oh, one or two more times for the year. And then we're done for the winter. And a uh, <laughs> little tap in here. I told you guys, I got a mole problem. Um, and uh, the last video I just did, I was hoping you guys would give me some good ideas how to uh, address these guys. Otherwise, I get to do uh, my little Irish dance here every week or so. Marching down these. It's a good thing. Uh, so when you make fun of your husband that might be overweight, just tell him to go out and crush molehills. That's where we really come in handy. But uh, yeah. So, uh, <laughs> gosh, I think I got them all. So anyway, uh, our watering system uh, will be shutting her down oh, in the next, oh, by November. Then we have a crew come in and actually blow out the lines. And I've never done it before, so we're gonna hire them again. Uh, my son watched them do it once, but uh, I'm going to learn how to uh, blow out the lines eventually too, so. How's your project? My grill cart with its new wheels. 
grill cart. Oh, so you're gonna use a gorilla cart? You're gonna get the new wheels all dirty. Yep. <laughs> of course, it may not look so dorky. I still think that it looks like little donuts on the back. But there it is. New wheels and all. We love that cart, by the way. All right, moving on. Okay, well, I know it's dark in here and I apologize, but people want to keep asking me, uh, are, is my mouse trap still working? And uh, I'll let you be the judge of that. Um, for one or two days, I didn't catch any, but uh, one of my traps in this shop here um, definitely caught a couple of mises. So, uh, yeah, I'm pretty happy about that. Um, I do have another one set up back here. Oh, someday we'll have access to this thing. Um, I have one in the back here and nothing. Once again, I'm sorry about the light. But anyway, uh, yeah, the mice tra traps continuously work. And uh, uh, the only thing I do is keep my dogs away from them from eating the peanut butter. But yeah, they're uh, very effective. Well, guys, we're wrapping up our evening here, and I uh, hope everybody has a great day. Uh, please take the time to like and subscribe to our channels and share our videos when you can. I thought I'd do a little quick cook here. I like to go, um, I don't know if you see these, I don't know what they're actually called, but you see them at the stores all the time. They're little strips of uh, beef you can get. They're nothing fancy, <laughs> but they're really super. They cook fast. They taste great. Um, you can flavor them any way you want. I'm just doing uh, salt and pepper, garlic, a little bit of a buttery steak rub that I got at Costco. And uh, uh, they're, <laughs> they're just a good serving. They're not too big. They're not too filling. They taste great. Um, it's a cheap man's, <laughs> cheap person's uh, steak. And uh, anyway, so I'm going to whip up uh, two of these in the Traeger. I'm just now getting this in the smoking mode. They're a little bit frozen when I put them in here, so I'm going to smoke them for about 15 minutes just to thaw them out a little bit more, too. Then crank it up to about 300, 325, and they'll cook super fast. And uh, there you go. You have dinner. So there you go. Get yourself a Traeger someday. But you can do this on a regular grill if you want to. It's all up to you. Um, I just like the smokiness. So, hey, guys, have a great day. Thanks for watching. Bye now. Thank you very much for watching our video. Please take the time to like, subscribe, and share our videos all over the whole wide world. Thanks.